We've been living in containers for about 16 months now, so here's how we're getting on. On the whole, we're warm and comfortable. Sarah keeps a couple of drawers of beetles in the sitting room. <laughs> they started off as mealworms to feed the chickens. We've now got two drawers of beetles that live in porridge oats and get regular vegetables. The intention is that they'll one day become mealworms again and she'll have more chicken food. But there's a strong possibility that she'll make friends with them and she won't be able to do that. Installing the big picture window made a big difference. In the evening when the fire's running, the container's quite cosy. I collect fallen timber with the truck and I drop it by the woodshed. Then it's just a matter of snipping it up with a chainsaw. A cantilever sawhorse makes this easier. Timber goes in the boxes where it stays dry and we use the sawdust in the composting loo. The woodshed's allowed us to get on top of the firewood and we've always got dry timber now. The woodshed collecting water and the second water tank made water much easier. We keep three outdoor storage bins. One has peat and sawdust for the composting loo. One generally has tea tree for starting fires. And the other's got dry kindling. We've got a dam. We haven't quite figured out what to do with it yet, but the frogs like it. The kitchen bathroom container still hasn't had much time spent on it.
we've changed the composting loo. The solar panels produce as much electricity as we really need. The fridge works quite happily. Here's the chicken hotel, they seem quite comfortable. The chickens are free range and very content and we get about two eggs a day. The garden hasn't had much tension and the plant is a bit neglected at the moment. The bananas seem to be doing okay, but I haven't seen much evidence of bananas. This is my outdoor workshop. With level support beams and a flat pallet, I can build pretty well anything. If you're enjoying these videos, you can see the entire project from start to where we are now at www.containerhouse.wordpress.com.